Yo, Philly 254 living life. Back at it. Destiny 2, Destiny 2, Destiny 2. There's a new DLC out in town. And I'm about to show you how we can go ahead and play that on the Steam Deck. Currently, there are two ways of playing Destiny 2 on the Steam Deck. And we're going to talk about one of those ways. Before we do all that. If you like the Steam Deck news and whatnot, like and subscribe. Click the notification bell. Do the YouTube Jasmine Ring. You know how it goes, man. And let's get into it. Now, as I stated, there are currently two ways to play Destiny 2 on the Steam Deck. One of those is dual booting or just installing Windows straight up on the Steam Deck. That's not really my jam. If that is your jam, big dog, shouts out to you. It's not really mine. And this video is more for the people who don't really want to do all that. And the other method that which we're going to be talking about today is cloud gaming via GeForce Now. It's just a few adjustments that need to be made, a few settings that need to be set, and then you're in there like swimwear. But let's get started with it. First things first, you're going to want to install Google Chrome. So where do you find it? That Discover Software Center. So all you're going to do is open that up. You're going to go to the search bar, type in Google Chrome, or you can just type in Chrome, and it's going to pull it up. All right, you can see Google Chrome, you can see Google Chrome unstable. Don't worry about that unstable. We're not trying to do nothing unstable. We're gonna install it. So as you can see, I've already got it installed, so I'm not gonna go forth the whole installation process. I've already got it installed. Next thing you wanna go ahead and do is you're gonna go ahead and go ahead and go into the, uh, I guess you call it the start menu, and type in terminal. You're gonna bring up the console. And then you're gonna, you're gonna have to put in a little handy dandy command. Now again, I've already gone through all this process, FYI. So I'm gonna just copy and paste what I've already typed in there. So there you go. I gotta put an F in the front there. I think I already I already, I already put that. Now I will put the actual command in the description, so that way you will see it visually, see what it is, because I know this is gonna be kind of small. Hit you type that up, put it in there, press enter, you're done. One final step. You're gonna want to open Steam. Why you open Steam? Because you want to make sure Chrome is gonna show up amongst all your other Steam games on the gaming mode. Because right now it's just gonna be only in desktop mode. So you open up Steam. You go up to the top where it says Games. It's gonna be a little option that says Add non-Steam game to my library. Click on that. You go see a list. It, I'm gonna use Firefox as an example. It, pretend like that's Chrome. On Chrome, you just click that little checkbox, and then you click on Add Selected Game. And then you're done. We're done on the desktop mode. That's actually the hardest part. We're just typing that little bit right there. So close that out, and then we're going to head up to the front. Now that we're on the front end, let's explain that little code we typed into the console a minute ago. That will allow the Chrome browser to read your Steam Deck's controls, all right? Because otherwise, it wouldn't have worked. It would have read it as a keyboard and mouse. So you're going to go over and press your Steam button, go to your library, click on non-Steam, so that way you can see your Google Chrome. You can launch it straight from there. Once you launch it, it's going to pull up and do its little jazz meringue. But before you do anything, you want to go to the, the gamepad layout. We got to switch that around just a little bit. And you, want, you only have to do all this once now. You want to change it to gamepad with joystick trackpad. That way, when, you, when you're in the actual browser, you can use your right trackpad to actually move the mouse around. Same thing with, in, within certain games. You use the, mouse, the right trackpad to move the mouse around. Click the right track, trackpad. I can't get those words out. Click the right trackpad so that way it, it acts as a mouse click. Perfect, right? And then all the other buttons on your Steam Deck will just be buttons, you know, just like you would do. So anyway, we're going to launch it. Press play. It does its thing. Launches Google like it would. So what you would do is you go into like the search bar, the URL or whatever, and type in GeForce Now. Once you type that in, It'll start to launch it. I've already typed it in already, already, and I actually saved it as a bookmark, so that way I just can click it. I don't have to look for it anymore. So I'm just going to click it right here. It takes a few seconds to launch, and once it comes up, you're almost there. You're almost to the clear. You just got one last thing you got to do. You got to sign in to GeForce Now so you can see Gaming Library. Uh, if you haven't signed up for GeForce Now, remember you got to connect GeForce Now to your Steam library so we'll see everything that will actually be playable. Once that's been completed, you're in there. So you can just click on see all, see your library. Right now I'm trying to get it over there so you can see all the library, but you can just click on see all. Once you click on see all, you're gonna see all of your games. See, right there. And you can just move on down, move around, or you can browse, but the easiest way that I find is just to go to the very top and actually just 
hit the little search bar and just search for it. So for example, we're just gonna type in DES, there you go, Destiny 2. We're gonna go on down there, click it, press play. Again, we're, we're using a right trackpad to both move the mouse and actually click. So you just click the right trackpad, all right? Just FYI, because all the other buttons may not work. I don't think they will. Once that's done, it's gonna take a few moments to kind of do a thing, click on full screen. It may pop up, pop up the little battle line, letting you know that, hey, we're looking after cheaters, cool, whatever, hit okay. And I'm gonna cut it just a little bit because it takes a few seconds for it to actually launch the game. And we're gonna move on. And there we go. Destiny has launched. Ready to go. But for proof for proof of concept, I'm gonna go ahead and just jump into a game right now. So I have not installed Lightfall about Lightfall or anything. Actually, I was playing Destiny on Stadia, so all my DLC was there. Rip Stadia. So none of my DLCs is actually here. I'd have to buy them all or whatever. So whatever, screw it. But I am thinking about getting life off, just FYI. So we're gonna go ahead and let it do its thing. And as you can see, everything's coming up. No problems, battle lies, not tripping because technically we're not playing it directly off the Steam Deck, although I wish we could. Bungie quit playing with us. Now I'm using the actual trackpad, not the trackpad, the left, joy, the left game stick to actually move around, as you can see, no problems, no problems. But I'm gonna show you something, I'm gonna show you something. I'm moving around now, but oh, there goes the mouse. That's, that's the trackpad. Move it around again, and let's play. And there we go, we are in, in there like swimwear. Moving every, moving around, no problems. Now I'm struggling a little bit because I'm trying to remember what buttons do what, as far as ducking and whatnot, but yeah, I'm definitely in there. I'm moving everything around with the left, I guess call it a joystick. I guess the left joystick or whatnot, and no problems. And of course, we can use the mouse using the right trackpad to to reach those other options towards the top to make any other adjustments towards the game or whatever. Everything works smoothly. Everything works fine. No issue. Now, this is only one of the methods. Again, I'm just gonna punt that out there. It's only one method. Only one of the methods. The other is, of course, the Windows method. Just didn't really feel like doing all that. This one. I mean, yeah, technically you got to have a, uh, well, you don't have to, but you need to go ahead and have GeForce Now and they have the paid subscription and whatnot. I'll throw a link to GeForce Now so you can see what, see what you want to do with it, if you want to use it or not. But for me, I've already had GeForce Now and it's a win-win for me, so I ran with it, all right? But you can do what you want to do with it. It's cool. If you want to go to Windows method, that's, that's perfectly cool too. It's just up to you, whatever you feel more comfortable with and whatever you feel like doing. Anyway, if you like more Steam Deck news, gameplay, whatnot, like and subscribe. Cruise through the playlist. And we're out.